Hello, this is Ramon Burgos. This video is for Mr. Green. And I want to thank Green for uh, all the time that he has took and invested material, supplies, so that I can better myself and what I love to do in the art. And I want to also thank one more person that has been a great inspiration unto me, and it was Miss Phyllis. She has showed me a lot of things that are that I know today that I put into folk art, and I'm going to get into that in a minute. But um, I remember when I entered a class, I did 12 years with her. She said, do the best that you can in this piece of paper. So when I went and I took the piece of paper, I started drawing mountain scenes with the skies, and then I started doing the sea, and then I started doing all these details in an eight and a half by 11 paper. And she looked at it, and she scribbled it. And I was like, oh my God, that was one of my best pieces. And she goes, you can do better. And she flipped the um, paper to the other side. And she goes, start all over on this side and try to do something different. And to make a long story short, she had broadened my mind and to do what I'm doing today. And I thank her for it because it worked. And I thank you, Green, for appreciating my work. Now, my wife is going to go around and show you the table that we have today that part of what Ms. Phyllis has showed me and what Mr. Green inspired me to do because he's a great inspiration and led me to have my own little business here in Puerto Rico. Here goes the table. Hello, this is Doris Ramon Burgos' wife. Um, I'm showing you the sign that we have, the artisan sign. And over here, we're going to start here with a coconut that Ramon painted. And I mounted it. I'm going to show you all the way around the coconut. And down here, we have a elephant head a mask in puerto rico they have this town where they have the festival of masks and ramon made an abstract of a mask over here we have also the taino gourd which we work on is what the taino indians used to use before for plates and for utensils for jewelry ramon made a beautiful rose inside we also have from the coconut branch that we also work on, we would run the tusk, the husk, the snout of the elephant, and it's make it on the coconut branch. This particular coconut branch has a sackcloth that grows from the bottom of the branch, and we do the mounting on it. And we also put on the back some screws so people could hang it up. This is wood burned and painted. We also have the scenery that Ramon made, painted. We do wood burning. Here Ramon did a wood burned hibiscus flower with a hummingbird. We have also pots, cups of coconut, pots that we make from the Taino gourd like this one, that is a ladybug. This is also on the pots, also Ramon's puts flowers. Ramon does some abstracts. Here we have a mythological Roman horse that Ramon made. And it has different pictures or objects around it from sea creatures to leaves to seaweed to a human figure right over here. We have also this eel that I mounted from the coconut branch, the blue eel and a fish that Ramon also I mounted and Ramon did the painting on it. We have a crocodile head from the coconut branch. Taino symbols such as the sun, the baby. Ramon did an, another abstract here from bamboo. This is also wood burned. Tulips that Ramon does, wood burned. He made wood burned on this bamboo. You can see all the details on the roses on this wood burned bamboo. And also here you see some sea creatures, the bamboo. We also work on, we have these little, 
This is also like for the kitchen that we use. People mash their plantains on it. Ramon did a beautiful abstract of mountains. We work on the maracas. And on the maracas here, you can see Ramon made palm trees on it. We actually hand make each and every one of these. Here we have another beautiful abstract on a cutting board. Ramon is going to pick it up. Here we have a hibiscus flower. On this abstract, half of it you can see an African face. Then on the left side you can see a pelican, the flag of Puerto Rico, and you see El Morro from San Juan, which is right over, on the, it's like the castle, one of the castles from El San Juan that the Spaniards used to have. It was a fort, actually. And we have all these other maracas that Ramon has hand painted. On these little mortars also for crushing garlic, Ramon does wood burning on them. These are sunflowers, beautiful sunflowers. And also this other one of palm trees over here with birds around it. Every piece that we make is a unique piece. You'll only see it once in a lifetime because as it gets sold, then we make other new different things also. So, and we also make from wood, from the Taino gourd and from bamboo, we make also um, necklaces and surfer bracelets. And a beautiful eel, large. And I showed them the eel, yes. yes. Okay, so this is a little artisan stand from Puerto Rico, the beautiful island here. We're right next to the beach. So you may hear a little wind sound. So you'll get a little glimpse of our ocean here and it's sunset. So come and visit the beautiful island of Puerto Rico.